All right, so I turned off test nav, uh, the auto launch. What we're going to do instead, all right, if you need to log in for, say, a science assessment or you're doing a park makeup, you go down here next to the shutdown button from the login screen is apps. You just click on apps and then you select test nav and then you will get your fun and familiar test nav auto launching. Do not log in from the website, that will mess you up. You can only get into test nav by, by launching the app from the login screen. All right, thanks. Hello, Mr. Benora here. I want to show you um, some features of the NJSLA. Uh, this is the new science test. Uh, if you are familiar with the park test, you'll be familiar with the interface of the NJSLA. Um, we have here a fifth grade uh, example test that I pulled up uh, to navigate through questions. You just hit the forward. If you want to go back, you hit the back. To select um, exactly uh, what your answer is going to be, all right, supplies electric current, right, let's say battery, carries the current, wire coil, and causes the coil to spin magnet. I hope I know my fifth grade science. All right, then I can go to my next question. All right, let's say I wanted to measure how long that uh, wire is. I can bring out my inch ruler, and I can measure it. I can even adjust if I want to get kind of a diameter there. That works. Uh, I can turn the ruler off. I can bring up my notepad, take some notes, close that out. I have a calculator for function calculator. Eighth graders, you'll have a different calculator. I still have my answer eliminator. I even have a straight edge, which is pretty cool. All right, and a protractor. Notice I can only have one tool on screen at a time. All right, let's say I'm not sure about this one. I will bookmark this question, move along. When I go back to review, there's a little bookmark right there on question number two. It also shows me that I don't have an answer for questions t uh, two through ten. All right, actually two through fifteen. Sixteen, look at that. All right, when I go to the end of this section, uh, if I'm done, I submit my final answers, but notice I have 15 questions not answered and one bookmark I should go back to. So I'm going back to review. I'll skip to question eight. I can go wherever I need to go. All sorts of different ways to answer questions here in the signs test. Make sure you are doing everything that you need to do. Make sure you're scrolling through all of your questions and all of the text. You might be missing a point. If that was below that scroll bar, you'd miss the key there, and that would be, uh, well, disastrous if you're taking a test. You want to make sure you can see everything you need. For example, the bottom of this table, I have to scroll down for. I can either scroll by grabbing that and going down, or if I'm on a Chromebook, I can do the two-finger scrolling option. And notice there's two places to put my answers there. That's pretty much all you'll need to know about the NJSLA. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, you should ask your teacher, because um, you're probably just about to take the test. All right. Uh, good luck, everyone.